Today, I will show you how to apply for ESOL at City of Glasgow College. First of all, if you visit Google and type in City of Glasgow College in the search bar, then you'll be able to go into our website, which is cityofglasgowcollege.ac.uk. When you're on our website, click Find a Course. Enter keyword. At this point, you can change the language to one of your preference. All you need to do is click onto the flags to choose your language. Type the ESOL in the keyword. You will then be on the ESOL webpage. You can read about more information about the course, including when it starts, the entry requirements, and what to do after. Click Apply Now to make an application. At this point, you'll need to enter your email address Your first name, and your date of birth. Click Create New Account. You will then be sent instructions to your email address. Log into your email and follow the link. You will be asked to create a new password. You'll then need to confirm this again and click Save. Now you're into your application. Scroll down and click Begin an application here. In your application, you will see different boxes and you'll see the incomplete. You'll need to update your details so that changes to a green box and says complete at the end. Click view to fill in the details. English for speakers of other languages should come up automatically, but if it doesn't, you can scroll through to find this. You will then need to click Submit. You will then be asked for your personal details. Click View to complete this section. Next, you'll be asked what country you're from and your nationality. Fill in your date of birth in this section here. Enter your contact phone number. We will ask you for information about your residency. 
including how many years you've lived in the UK and your current residency status. We will also ask you for documentation. Make sure you select this so that we know whether you can study the course and upload any relevant documentation. If you don't upload this, we will notify you to send us information later. Please add expiry date on the document that you have. We will ask you where you learned about the course. We will then ask you a little bit more information about you. This is so that we can support you through the course. You can select the prefer not to see option at any point. Please ensure you give as much information as possible. If you have support needs, please tell us about them here. We will need this so that we can support you through the course. Please select if you have any disabilities or long-term health conditions which you'd like to disclose. We will ask you about any relevant unspent criminal convictions. You'll need to disclose this. Declaring a conviction will not necessarily prevent you from studying at the college. However, the college will need to know that information in order to provide a safe learning environment. If you have any questions regarding this, you can get in touch and discuss this confidentially. At the end, you will be asked about data protection. This is to make sure that we have relevant information and we keep the information that we need. You'll need to agree to these statements. At the end, each section should have complete box and it should be green. Then you'll be able to check and submit at the bottom. If you need to make any changes, you can do this now. At the end, click Submit My Application. And that's it. That's you submitted your application. You should now receive thank you for your application message and confirmation from us. We will get in touch if there are any changes to your application, such as being invited to an interview or if we have any further questions. You can also find out about ESOL 
and make an application by clicking studying at the city and then having a look at information on how to apply and then clicking on um, ESOL English as a second or other language. If you have any questions, you can get in touch with us by emailing on ESOL applications at cityandglasgowcollege.ac.uk or by giving us a call on 0141 375 you can also visit us in person by coming to the second floor of the city campus.